right, a uh, bunch of new features over the last two nights. Uh, shout out first to DTN, um, helped put together the um, battery fix that we have here in the uh, for Mermenu. So this is a community built uh, change to improve the way that battery uh, is reported um, based on the stock battery that's in there. And so uh, basically what you can do here is just patch the, uh, the firmware file. Uh, it'll do some checking to see if you already have the patch or if you're uh, on the latest. Uh, if you're not, then um, it will uh, push you to upgrade to the latest and then it'll let you do the, uh, the fix. I already had it on this card. Um, also added the ability to uh, delete multiple uh, ROMs. So you can do two things. Uh, you can select the full list uh, and then you could delete all those ROMs. I'm obviously not going to do that. You can also use uh, mouse pointer and uh, control key and you can select you know multiple ROMs that you want to delete uh, and then, then click this here and then when it's uh, you know uh, when you're not on a ROM, it will disable, um, which took long, way longer than it should have. Um, two other things that we built tonight. Um, first, Glass was looking at, uh, you know, changing his themes. And when you change your theme, so let's go to um, something like the black theme. Uh, we have a pop-up now that's just telling you, hey, if you've set any of your shortcut icons, uh, it's going to overwrite those. So before I hit that, right, like if I load up here, I'll, I'll explain that in a second. I've set these game shortcuts. Um, I've put in some, some helper strings here in case you forgot what you had. But basically, uh, when you uh, use a new theme, um, I'm going to go and say yes because I want to use this theme. And now when I go back into uh, preview, uh, you'll see that, again, we'll talk about this dialogue in a second, uh, you'll see that we've blown uh, those uh, icons away because those are actually part of the background image. So now what you'd have to go do is uh, essentially find every single one of your icons and do this uh, for all your systems. So uh, Glass was wondering if we could have like a favorites feature uh, in lieu of like a favorites list that you can swap in. Uh, I put together this um, basically experience where if you've done Screen Scraper, uh, it will change the PNG names based on the ROMs that it finds. So again, similar to thumbnails, uh, now you can just go in here, I'm, I'm in the right folder for FC, uh, and actually, uh, you know, find your folder. And what it's going to do is match those strings with the shortcuts that you've already selected. Uh, and then you just click Save. Uh, and then you're good to go. And again, similarly, if I wanted baseball stars to be number two, uh, it's going to tell me that I've switched from Blaster Master over to baseball stars. I can come in here. Do I want to do this? Yes, I do want it to find the right icons. Uh, come in here and then you'll see the baseball stars icon uh, is replaced. You'll also notice uh, that these icons look a lot better uh, thanks to uh, Doggy World. Is that what we got? Um, uh, I think so. Make sure I got it right. Uh, doggy world. Yes. Thanks, man. Uh, or lady or uh, whatever you go by. Uh, and uh, those look a lot cleaner and they should look really good on the themes as well. So I think, um, again, that, that feature works across all these. So again, if I'm in, uh, in here, changing some things, picking icons. And if for some reason the matching doesn't happen or it gets it wrong, uh, it's fine. Um, in fact, these, did I click now? Uh, I might have to check to see why this didn't update, right? Um, but anyway, you like in this case, I think I just haven't iterated correctly on the right console, but you can go in here and change these if it doesn't get it correct. Oh, I know, because I, I picked the NES, uh, the NES folder when I did that. So when I went in here, uh, it doesn't go fancy in a lot of folders, so I clicked uh, NES, so it did matching, and uh, it did not find them, but that's because my SNES... Um, images are in a different folder. So if I come in here, I think it'll pick it up. Yeah, there we go. Actraiser 2, Actraiser. Um, oh, funny enough, uh, these, I think that's coming from a, a stock file there. So if there was no game uh, selected, then they won't show up there as well. Uh, it'll, it won't replace them, obviously, because there's no match one to it. And click save. All right, uh, I think we're wrapping up uh, for a bunch of these features and probably uh, I'll put together a much longer video walking through all the new experiences. 
uh, and then we'll probably call it pretty much done, test for a while, and then push this out. We're working uh, working with Eric uh, to get this integrated into the, the